right, we're back, horse, with an update for the upcoming state of play. We talked about this not too long ago. We had a, a bit of info coming from Jeff Grubb that there would be a state of play happening towards the later half of September. We have an update now from an insider called Lunatic Ignis. I've not personally ever heard of them, but they put out something on Discord, I believe, today that has more like concrete info in terms of like a date for when the state of play is happening and that it's apparently going to be like kind of a bigger state of play and I believe also teasing like a PS5 Pro announcement next week. As I mentioned previously, I've never heard of this particular leak here, but that doesn't really matter because I've never heard of any of them. That's always like new to me. I don't really, really keep up with like the popular leakers, I suppose. But according to an article that I read when I was like looking into this, uh, upcoming like state of play rumors or whatever, they accurately predicted the date of the May state of play that happened earlier this year. So they obviously have some sort of inside info. Also, apparently the PS5 Pro stuff that they seem to be teasing for next week kind of falls in line with another leaker's information, Bill Bill Kuhn, I think is how you say his name. Who was saying that we'd be getting like the PS5 Pro stuff in like the first half of September? So, anyways, Ignis dropped this on Discord that says Sony will hold a pretty big state of play next week. The big announcement that all of you are eagerly waiting will take place on Tuesday slash Wednesday. For those asking how big, it will have first party content, including a world premiere that I'm waiting for. Now, 100% about the world premiere being at this event or the Game Awards, take it with a grain of salt. And they followed that up with I'm sorry for another tag, but I was a little bit wrong about this. I mixed some things here. The big announcement will take place next week, and the state of play will take place on the 19th or the 20th of September. It's pretty strange for Sony to do that, but I can always be wrong with this. Sorry again. So at least according to them, the PS5 Pro announcement would be happening next week ahead of the State of Play, which is a little bit strange. Maybe they want to like, kind of like they did with the PS5, I guess, back in like 2020, where they're like, I think they talked about it ahead of time. Like, hey, this upcoming event is going to be for the PS5. Maybe they want to reveal it next week and maybe show more of it at the State of Play or something. Or maybe it has its own event next week. I don't entirely know. They did also mention it's going to have first party content and also a world premiere. They're being vague, obviously, about the world premiere. They're not saying what it is. Maybe that's to like hide the identity of who they get the information from because... Like, maybe there's not that many people out there that know what this world premiere is, so maybe that's why they're being vague about it. In terms of, like, the first-party games, it's kind of exciting, obviously, because PlayStation does put out, you know, traditionally pretty damn good exclusives, so it's kind of exciting. I'm, I am curious what the world premiere would be. I, I don't even have a guess, because it's a world premiere. And actually, think about it now. If, like, they're going to announce the PS5 Pro next week, but there's also going to be, like, first-party content with it in a world premiere, that does sound like some sort of uh, event or whatever, like, where they maybe, like, live stream and talk about the PS5 Pro, and then next week would also have a state of play. Kind of interesting, I guess. You know, you know, the next two weeks will be pretty good, hopefully. Also, according to them, the state of play that's happening this month will either be on the 19th or the 20th, which the 19th is exactly two weeks from today, so Thursday of that week or Friday of that week. As we talked about before in videos where we talk about the state of play, like, they usually announce it, like, officially from, you know, PlayStation or whatever, like, a, a day or two. Like, a lot of times it's, like, tomorrow, this time, state of play is happening, so... We probably won't get anything official from them until that week at some point. That's more or less it for the video, my dudes. We're not going to hold you too long with this one. We talked enough about upcoming gaming events and games we want or hope to see there. I'm just repeating myself at that point if we talk about that shit. So hopefully something interesting will happen in the next week or two. That's all I'll say. Anyways, that's the video. Subscribe to channel if you guys are new. Social networks in the description below. Follow me through dash yt That's it. Bye. Used to care what people thought, but now I care more. And nobody out here's got it figured out. So therefore, I've lost all hope of a happy ending. Depending on whether or not it's worth it. So insecure, no one's perfect. We spend it with no shame. We blow that. Like old train, we in here. Like low gain, or leave it. Like old bang.